Hey everybody, what's up? Welcome back to another episode of Everything Kratom, the podcast about anything and everything Kratom. Great to have you with us on this Wednesday morning, hoping all is well with you. Today I just wanted to briefly share a quick thought I've been having recently, and it's pretty much as follows. You know, I think a lot about how many different ways people use Kratom. Of course, you know, not approved by the FDA. I'll throw that out there right now. But people self-report using Kratom for so many different reasons. Now, there's a lot of them that are talking about getting off of other drugs. There's a lot of them talking about pain. There's a lot of them talking about um, energy and motivation, things like that. But then there are also other things. And, you know, restless leg syndrome is one of them that actually people have written into me about. Um... Wow, there is a noisy bird standing right next to me here. <laughs> if you can hear that, lucky you. Um, anyway, don't worry, this episode's brief. I've been thinking about it, and basically here's my thought as follows. Thank you, Mr. or Mrs. Bird. That how many of these different uses for Kratom actually funnel down into the same reasoning? So like less restless leg syndrome, for instance, of course, again, not approved by the FDA to use Kratom this way, but a lot of people seem to be using it for that. That's a pretty specific one. But then when you're talking about like, you know, um, anxiety, for instance, there might be something that like is someone saying, I use Kratom for social occasions. Well, why? Maybe they say, because I get anxiety and it helps me with that. So that is kind of what I'm getting at. That filters down into anxiety as one reason. So I look out there, I look at the internets, and I find all these different reasons people report using Kratom, and there are a lot of specific situations people mention that can be kind of filtered down into some general similar reasoning, but the way that that reasoning kind of is, is, the way it manifests itself is pretty wide-reaching so that what you end up having is a bunch of people using kratom maybe it all breaks down to the word anxiety but when you look at well what's the anxiety for and how does it help you with those things it is all over the map so it'd be kind of fun to like map that out actually i'd love to see a visual and i now propose a challenge does anyone want to try that i have to get away from this bird (laughs) i'm gonna end it there i'm sorry you guys it's a bit crazy today this is the only place I could find to do the episode recording and this bird (sighs) has just jumped right in so I'll let the bird sign off for me talk to you as soon as I can maybe tomorrow if I can